Sheriff? Just cork it. You see this badge? Know why it's here? It came with the shirt. It's here because if there's a crime, I solve it. Oh, and by the way, I've called all your parents, who by now I have on speed dial. Oh, 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 oh are you in trouble? Especially you, Fred. Say hi to Dad, the mayor. Just once it would be nice if someone thanked us for solving a mystery. Good thing we're not in this to be light. You know, that didn't come out quite right. Muffin, how about you and me go for a moonlight ride? No, thank you. I'm allergic to the stink of desperation. Then you don't know what you're missing. Step away, huh? From the lady. What do we have here? Seriously, what do we have here? <laughs> <laughs> We are the wild brood, human. And this is our most terrifying leader, Oddnob the Powerful. He demands that you vacate the premises immediately. You want us to leave our own place? In a word, yes. <laughs> this roadhouse is spanker territory. So unless you want a mouthful of spanker... Cool it, Daddy. We tried taking the high road. Didn't we, Gab Trap? Yes, we did indeed. Fun. A round of cappuccinos for my orcs and make them extra frothy. Sh -sh -sh sure thing, buddy. So you fellas gonna be sticking around here for long? We're headed down the coast to Crystal Cove for a little rest and relaxation. Crystal Cove? <laughs> Even the name sounds breakable. The local Clydes won't soon forget the wild brood. Right, brothers? <laughs> <laughs> Like, how you feeling, pal? Never better. <laughs> Great. I was worried there for a second we'd have to leave you behind. Fred? What? The Mystery Solver State Finals is tomorrow. Every teen mystery solving group from around the country will be there. You mean there's more than one of us? It's being held right here in Crystal Cove. Whoever wins will be declared the best mystery-solving team and go on to compete in the Olympics. Olympics? I don't think that's right. Well, I'm sure the prize will be something big in Greek. I'm sorry, Fred, but we can't go to the finals with Scooby sick like this. Oh, right. No, of course not. Will you excuse me a second? No! <laughs> why? 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 Don't worry, Scoob. I got just what you need. Chicken soup! Here! Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Maybe you guys should go without me. <laughs> no, you're part of the team, Scooby. What good are we without our sidekick? Sidekick? Thelma! 
What she means is... I know what she means. Hi, right, come on, gang. Let's let him get some sleep. Whew. Sidekick. Is that all I am? No, no, I'm cured. I'm cured. I'm cured. <laughs> like what? Way to go, Scoob. Must have been that chicken soup. I'll say. Well, what are we waiting for, gang? We've got a Mystery Solvers Club State Finals to win. Oh, man, this is going to be great. I can't wait to meet our uh -huh. competition. because I went to the prom with Velma instead of watching the Vincent Van Gogh Marathon with him. Listen, Hex Girls, carefully. You are bound for misery. This will be your final show, or you will suffer endless woe. So saith the Phantom. No one tells the Hex Girls what to do. I was hoping we could escape, make our way to Schaffhausen, find other humans, try to... Shh, just rest. I'll get a bandage. No, a zombie bite. There's nothing that can be done for me now. Already I feel myself changing, becoming like... Don't say that. You'll be fine. We'll just use more antiseptic. Ah! Promise me. Promise me you'll bolt the door and never let me in. No, I... You can't let me in. No matter how much I scream and wail, you mustn't let me in. No. You'll be fine. You'll see. Get out. Get out. Bolt the door. Now. I was just 
kidding before. Seriously, I think I left the burners in the kitchen on. Wiener! Look me in! Not me! Never get this from me, you little brats! Never! down on my hearing aid. Willard, you know I can't drink that much coffee. It aggravates my plumbing. Uh -huh. hey. uh -huh. What is it? Breach in Sector A. Emergency lockdown. On my way home now, darling. You did not heed my warning. Honey, what's wrong with your voice? It's so deep. Wait a minute. Is this that nut again? I told you, if you did not quit your job at Destroyo and leave forever, something terrible would happen to you. And I told you I don't appreciate prank calls. My sister-in-law is a paralegal, and if this keeps up, I'm suing you. Go suck a lemon! Oh, boy! The nerve of some people. Cicada thingies. I hate those bugs. Bich. What's going on? Hey, boy! Come on, shoot! Shoot! Ah, 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 hold him up! <laughs>
You know, I gotta hand it to you, Mayor. Crystal Cove needed a trendy hot spot like the Tiki Tub, and you delivered. The local Hepcats are gonna dig this crazy joint. Just one more check on the to-do list that'll turn Crystal Cove into the cultural slash paranormal center of the world. And let me congratulate you, Sheriff, on how quiet things have been around town. In the words of Abraham Lincoln, a quiet town is a place where people like to spend money. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Whoa. Hope you've got insurance, Mayor, because I want to see that again! Encore! Encore! why some people insist on dressing like pirates at a fair for knights. Because knights are boring. They're so, my lord this and my lady that. Joust me. Ooh, I've got the pox. Pirates, on the other hand, are awesome. Yar! I gotta fix this thing. <laughs> hmm? Huh? Hello? <gasps> hmm. <laughs> I could knit a sash in the time you're taking. May I help you? Do you have any jewelry? You know, like rings and stuff? Of course, right this way. Ooh, let me see that one. I'm not supposed to show that to anyone. Not even me? Oh, I, I guess it wouldn't hurt to let you look. <sighs> How much? I'm afraid it's not for sale. I'm just holding it for a customer. Chu Chow's trading post, Ray speaking. Well, thanks anyway. Look, just tie it down until I get home. Just here. But I, I. sure it's a good idea to go to an amusement park after just getting out of the hospital? I mean, we were kidnapped and manhandled by a really mean man crab. I believe it's crab handled, not manhandled, and it was all bogus, remember? They caught the guy. Creepy spooky terror land is totally safe. Besides, attendance is so bad the tickets are super cheap. 
Hey, hey, ride the nauseator. No waiting, ever. Look at that view, Bren. You can see all of Crystal Cove from here. You're right. From up here, it doesn't look like such a scary place to live. And maybe everything will turn out all right for us. Oh, Brenda. Oh, Dylan. Let's table our emotional embrace. Totes. At least we're together. And safe. <laughs> These grounds are now the domain of the Manticore. Hey, hey, ride the nauseator. No waiting, ever. Going once, going twice. Sold! The ringside seats to the Crystal Cove Lady Banshee's roller derby team go to Gary Buckwater. This charity auction is going better than I ever could have hoped. What's our total so far, Sheila? $34. Ah, oh, just imagine all the good $34 will do. The next lot up for bid is this spooky painting. Now that's what I call art. Do I hear five dollars? Uh, four dollars? Three dollars? Come on, this is a genuine spooky painting. Oh, this thing is creeping me out just looking at it. Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> Give me that painting! <laughs> It's not! We're trapped! Oh. 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 The vampire's gone! So is the painting! <gasps> That's the last net. Can we go home now, Dylan? Come on, Brenda. I promised the Trickles Trickwood people we'd do a good job setting up for the tournament. Ugh. I'm bored and sweaty. I hate manual labor. I can't wait for a time when robots do everything for us. Here, I brought some water. Ew! I don't want any of that fatty fat water. I want Trickles Trickwid. Trickles Trickwid is water. Uh, um, no. It's 100% diet moisture. You want me to look good in my bathing suit, don't you? Man, you are in a crabby mood. Please. You want to see crabby? I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> Bren, where'd you get that? The giant fake crab parts emporium? No! It's real! Help me! Ah! Yeah, nice try. What'd you do? Dig a big hole under the sand? <laughs> Bravo! Oh, bye. You got an air tank under there? Brenda? Come on, stop joking. Bren? <laughs> Do you realize you were speeding? Uh, yes, yes, I do, officer. Okay, as long as you know. On your way, then. Drive safely. Uh -huh. All right, you pull over. Uh, excuse me? Uh, are you aware that you're speeding? Uh -huh. A system of pulleys connected to a counterweight looped through that tree in this flagpole will drag that hot dog cart. Hot dogs? Stay with me, Scoob. Nobody's with you, Fred. 
It is a pretty complicated trap. That's exactly why it'll work. <sighs> Sometimes it's like I'm all alone out here. <laughs> Zoinks! <laughs> it's the Barana Goat! And we've got him right where we want him. <clears throat> hey, what's wrong with this thing? <laughs> Fred, he's getting away! <laughs> Going somewhere, Piranha Goat? Busted. Good thing Sheriff Stone showed up. Well, you're darn tootin'. I've told you kids a thousand times you leave the crime bustin' to the crime busters. Piranha Goat, you're coming with me. Huh? Hey, my trap's working. Uh oh. <laughs> Told you it would work. Later. Justice, he's returned. Let's hope old Neptune has been kind to us this time. Uh, salty scallops empty again. I hate to say it, but our only choice now is Dead Man's Point. But isn't Dead Man's Point haunted? Aye, it is what they say. And we probably won't come back alive. But don't forget, we're fishermen. We do stupid things all the time. <laughs> this fog is thicker than sea poop. <laughs> Always slays me, sea poop. Now, that's more like it. Huh? <laughs> what in the world? The legend is true! This is the way? My calculations don't lie. Why are we stopping? Because of that. The planispheric disk. Ow! What gives, bird? I was trying to save your life. Ding dong, Daddy-o! Booby trapped! Judy, if I may borrow your locket. I don't understand. There are six pieces. Where are the other five? Maybe they're underneath. Huh? A second booby trap! Run! Good 
job, Judy. Now all we need is the other five pieces. And the treasure is... Mine! You! The shrieking madness of Chargar Gothicon? The beast that hath no name? You're actually reading this? The professor is a great writer. His stuff is spooky. Hatecraft is a total fake. He says he's just writing what demons from dark dimensions tell him. Please! How do you know they're not true? Um, because I have a brain? Wait until Harlan Ellison speaks here next week. He's a real writer. He'll set you bozo straight about Hatecraft. Later. Chargar Gothicon, the beast that hath no name. How can Professor Hatecraft name the creature in the title then say it has no name? Ridiculous. <laughs> What is that smell? Marion, Kachinga. We found it. The ancient burial heap of Sklar Gringut. I told you, legend plenty true, Kachinga. Yes, amazing. Jinga, make plenty fast for camp. Fetch medicine kit for wifey. Bring here quickie quickie. KK? I'm sorry, honey. I know you're excited. Go on. I'll be fine here. Alone. Okay. Huh? Love ya! Take not my head or a curse on you. My body shall forever avenge the wrong you do. A curse? This day just gets better and better. Whoa. Ah! You were warned! <laughs> Is someone there? The cartwheeling kitchen, Camels, Fred. If you've snuck in here again to conserve body heat by lying across my legs. 
Fred? You! No! Not again! Santa? Wait, no! Dad! <laughs> I've got to get out of here! Let me go! But, Dad, what's happened? <laughs> Are you sure this is New York City? Yeah, absolutely. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this here is uh, Broadway. What's that street sign say? Gator Avenue. Hmm. I wonder how far Gator Avenue is from Broadway. According to this map, 2,000 miles. Well, in that case, so uh, we're going to need to fill up the tank. <laughs> Anybody there? Hello? Pedals! Come back! Pedals? There's, there's no such thing as... Gator Man! <laughs> He missed a game we're gonna win. Hey, he can't do that. Red card. No way. That was a clean steal. This is bogus. Oh, you are done as in cooked. Yeah, I get it. Well, what if I just. I told you I loved you so much. Okay, so maybe what I'm saying is... Huh? Who cares? It's just a game. You are so amazing. I love everything. Are tears of joy inappropriate? Not at all. Tears are just the beginning. to see me, sir. <laughs> Deliver these packages right away. Yes, Mr. Glubafani, Mr. Kovacin. Gabodoglophordia. How many times I gotta tell ya? Gabodoglophordia. Doglophy gabby. Tommy die, I think. Huh? Bedtime, Arthur. Nighty night, Daphne. You're the bestest babysitter ever. Mwah. That's odd. Who'd be playing a pan flute at this hour?
No more, Mom. Come on, come on. Look, I mean, that is like your third memory card. Sorry, it's just that I remember my prom. So much joy, so much passion. The best night of our lives, remember, dear? You didn't go with me. Oh, right. <sighs> okay, I'm late now. I gotta go. Thanks for coming with me, Randy. Can I make a little confession? This isn't my first prom. <laughs> what do you mean? Were you held back? No. At my other schools, I went to prom with other boys. Look, I just want to party hardy, <laughs> get my swerve on, you know. I just want you to know that I think you're the one. Are you, Randy? Are you the one? What? Be my boyfriend, Randy. Forever and ever and ever. <laughs> Are you sure that thing came in here, Brad? It's the only place it could have gone. For real, maybe we should call the local Smokey to handle this. Ricky's right. That thing didn't look exactly human. It had horns. The real question is, did we chase it here or were we let here on purpose? Uh, Professor Pericles! No! Come back! False alarm. It was just a possum. Mmm. Delicious. Sorry. Whoa, far out. What's that? What is this? No idea. But I can't wait to find out. From six to one, the spell is spun. No time to run, the curse begun. Oh, <laughs> 